Vivian Creek Trailhead, San Gregonio Wilderness. This is a steep trail. I mean, look down there. Way down there. We were down there, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes ago. We're about one mile in, maybe. It's all uphill. Look at the elevation. It's really steep. That's only one Action Jackson. He's been with me a couple times. And that other CRX lever, he's been with me a few times too. That'd be Vivian Creek. We'll show you it on a map. We're gonna take a break up here and get some water. Purging the new... He's trying out his new... MSR. It says it somewhere here. Fleet water. Do you need water from me? Don't have water. I only here. brought my Sawyer, but right now I'm set on water, so. Uh, he looked it up on the website last night. And he said there's how many more? Two more. Each each of the camps out here have a creek. Have there's a good two water more flow. two more water sources before we get to the top. So I'm not gonna fill up yet. I've got a tire leader here, and a small half leader over there. We'll stop up to have a little breakfast. Banana and stuff. Relax. So here's where we came up. They parked over here. And so far we've walked in to this Vivian Creek. And there's a campsite right up here. We have to go through. Continue on two more miles is another campground. Then two more miles is another campground. I'll get my water there. And then we go another 3.2.1.4 and we get to the summit. 11,502. We'll be sleeping there tonight. If all goes right. Okay, he's got the old Atmos 65 Osprey. And you have an REI. Venturi 45. I don't Venturi even know what that means. Venturi 45. Means. That's cool. And it's I, I have my jam with me. You guys have seen that hundred like times over. It's like a, like a 2.1 pounds. This is a cool area. Oh yeah, that looks awesome. Here's what we're going up into. Oh shit, we gotta go up there, huh? I think so. <laughs> this one's slippery though. Yeah. I gotta show what you just want. Okay, your turn. The fair. <laughs> the fair. Who knows? Might be thunderstorms up there. I haven't seen those two other guys in about 30 minutes. Hope they're behind me. I just want to make it to the top before nightfall. But I hear somebody up ahead. And in the parking lot, believe it or not, I saw something you will not believe. If I get her on film, you'll know what I'm talking about. Okay, I'm going to pan across her. Trying to make it look obvious. But check it out. Jason Voorhees and Michael Myers. Jason Voorhees and Michael Myers. More rare than Bigfoot. I found a perfect place to hang a line for the tarp shelter, the uh, pyramid. Actually, maybe not. <laughs> That's gonna come down any day. Mouse trap. Look at this view. 
Look at that. And a river runs through. Look at this. It's amazing. Down there you can tell where there's a spring. See all that green? Actually I can hear it. Oh man, you gotta see this view. Look at this. Oh yeah, there's the creek, look at that. It's flowing pretty good back here. Eventually I should have to cross that. Look at this place. I haven't seen any trout in the streams up here at all. Not even the baby ones. Thunderclouds moving in. The trail sort of disappears right here. Hopefully I can pick it up again. Okay, I just passed those two women right there and they said I have two and a half miles to go. About two hours they said. Right around this corner and then she goes straight up. I'm almost there guys. And she said I'll be the only one up there. Like Donkey from Shrek. I'm alone. <laughs> Water's at a full boil. Okay, to save on daylight, I poured the water in, put everything away, and this stuff takes 10 minutes to 12 minutes to, so I went ahead and started walking. After 10 minutes walking, I sat in and ate half of it. It's a steak with a pepper rice, pepper steak with rice. It's not a very good one. If I wasn't starving, I wouldn't have ate it. But look at that. I can see the trail over there. I'm almost there. I'm almost there, guys. Almost there. Last time I had the camera on, I was over there on that trail, looking this way. I've gone all the way down, around and I'm here. I've got to go all the way up this, to there. That's it. Top of Southern California. This old it's man made it. Look at this, these little flowers grow. You're gonna think I did this, but I didn't do this. Look at this, heart, boom. Boom, a perfect heart filled in. That's amazing. Check that out, Molly. I'm even above the weed line now. Matter of seconds here, or minutes, I'll be at the highest point in Southern California. Look at that. See what that is. It's a register. Cool. We we see this there used quick. to be a geocaching, some of the emptied. And there's like a plaque over here. Let's see this plaque. Cool. Mount San Gorgonio. 11503. There's a State one too. Okay, I'm standing. I am the tallest, I'm the highest man in Southern California on this date. I believe it's 8-8, eight, eight, or maybe it's 8-7, I'm not sure. I'll look in a minute. 8-8-12. Eight, 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 I'm the only man on the mountain. Down here there's a I believe it's a DC-10 crash from the from way back, 30, 40 years. They know about it, it's all in pieces. I don't know how many died, I don't know the story on it. I just heard about it through talking. Here, oh, there's a lake. Wow, look at that lake. Oh, it's Big Bear. It's Big Bear Lake. I'm taking my daughter fishing there before summer's over. 
I'm gonna rent a boat and have a great time. Look at this. Okay, I think that's where I'll sleep. There's a ring there and there's a ring there. I won't even use a tarp. Oh, and there's a ring over there too. I'll take that one or that one. I'll check them both out. Check it out guys, I made it. Lone man on the mountain tonight. I bought the map for this place more than a year ago and I've been wanting to come up here but I haven't been able to find anybody to come up with me. Well this week two people agreed. They made it to the halfway point and I ended up alone again. So alone on the summit. Cheers guys. Hey Jeannie. <laughs> Pretty cool to know you're the highest person in Southern California. 1,500 feet higher than Mount Baldy. I'm way up here, guys. I'm way up here. Should be a good sundown, and it should be a great sunrise. Sundown's kind of blocked by those mountains, but the sunrise, wide open. This is it. This is camp, guys. Let me set up, and I'll show you what I come up with. I wouldn't even use a tarp tonight. There's a better view of the sundown a little bit. That would be Big Bear Lake. Oh look, that guy's fly fishing right there. <laughs> Big Bear Lake out there. And over the other side of that mountain would be Arrowhead. There's some hot springs back here somewhere. Let's go catch that sunrise, sunset. Get out guys. Almost gone. Going. Gone. See that genie? Now your dad's gotta get back over there. Sunset's gone. I got a rash in that water, so I still got a little bit of that food left, but I'm I'm not really hungry. I am going to get to sleep, believe it or not. Wake up early, have myself some oatmeal, some coffee, and head on down. It's about 100 today. That temperature is dropping fast. I'm glad I brought this bivy. I'm going to leave my shorts on. I can't sleep with socks. I'm going to leave my shorts on, my shirt on. I'm, I'm going to sleep. Check that out. I'm at 11,000 feet, and I can hear nothing. I don't know what that is going across. I don't know if it's a satellite or what. It's cold. Oh, last night. Got way low. That 45 bag. Look at my hand. Oh, that 45. Look at my leg. Oh, that 45 bag didn't work last night. Whoo! I have shorts. This thing here. This little wrap that used for the sun. I wrapped in this, inside that bag. That's the only thing that kept me semi-warm. Oh. Wow, it's cold. Oh. I'm gonna stop shaking, I'm some hot coffee. There's some water on the boil down there. I'm gonna have a cup of coffee. It, it is the coldest I've been in more than a decade. <laughs> it is cold. My knee was bothering me anyway. So I got the yeast bandage on there to warm that leg. I've got a bandana on there to warm that one. And I've got this one on like the Cape Crusader. Oh, whoo -hoo. it is cold. Let's go check out the sunrise. I didn't have anything to measure the coolness, but here's how cold it was. I couldn't get my uh, butane stove to light. I had to roll that fuel around in my, in my hands to warm it up to get that fuel to light. Ooh, it was just sputtering. Here's a look from the northwest side. That's Gorgonio right up there, the highest point, Southern California. And here's a look down 
the northern side, look at this. But with that smog, I don't think we're gonna see too much. Another lake. That one's got an island, which tells me that'd probably be Lake Paris. Wow! <laughs> that would probably be Lake Paris out there. It's an island. Huh. I've got to go down over this, over this, around this, around this, around this mountain, and around three more. <laughs> well, I got down walk. right around that corner and saw these guys. So I'm going to go back up with them, film them in the rings, include them in the video. They earned it. Well, I got down around this bend here, this first one, to the base of the mountain, and I saw these guys sitting down didn't recognize them at first but uh they want to summit and um they don't have cameras with them they ditched their packs around that second mountain somewhere so they're coming up with no packs but they want me to come up and film them so i'm going to summit for the second time within 24 hours in the last time, unless my brothers want to do it with me someday. <laughs> okay, here we are. Both made it, right on. It took a hell of a lot to get up here. How was it? It's tough, the air is thin. Yeah. How was it, man? It took a whole lot of inspiration. <laughs> it's awesome though, getting up here. Yeah, I, I spent the night in that ring right over That's there. That pepper stick with rice. I only ate about half it last night, maybe less than half, I, don't, I didn't like it. But the chipmunk over here, he loves it. Look at him. I gave him some. Look at him. See what I can find. Break, break it out, brother. Check him out. He's eating my yeah, rice. Chicken. Look at him. Look at him. He, he, he'll, he comes up, eats right out of your hand. People must feed him a lot. Okay, it's 9 o'clock. We're headed down again. I'm headed down again. I'm familiar with this hike. Or if you're looking at a map, I just passed Middle Camp, and right back there, I'm seeing huge bolts of lightning and rain and thunder. I think thunderstorms coming in. I'm gonna haul and get out of here. I believe those guys are gonna be coming back drenched. I've not seen them in two hours now. Look at those. There's a mama deer and three babies. See if I can get on the other side. They were right here. One baby. Mama, two babies. The other one must have been up ahead. Pretty cool. Here's a little spring. It goes down. I can hear the river over there. So once this trail crosses this river, I've got my five, six, seven switchbacks across the riverbed and I'm out. I think I'm gonna beat this thunderstorm. I don't know about the other two guys, but I think I've got it beat. I'm down in the riverbed. That thunder lightning is really cracking. Over there, you can see rain. It's headed that way. Just came down off those switchbacks the car. I don't know if you can hear that thunder or not. There it goes. Oh, see the lightning? This. Hit the parking lot and watch watch in front of the screen. I don't know if you can see it, but the rain has started. It's real light now. I don't know if it's stay that way for very long. Yeah. Home sweet home. Whoa. See the drops on the ground? I just made it. 
156. Left the summit, I think at 8.50 this morning. This is the parking lot. It's also the campground. Huge bolts of lightning and thunder. Collapse of thunder. I think it's going to start pouring here any second. And I'll be in there waiting Before for I can even put my stuff in, it's hailing. This is hail. Big old piece of hail. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I is that timing it. it or is that timing it? Those poor dudes are gonna get drenched. Okay, it's how, how long I have to wait you for You made them. it, man. Did you guys get rained on? No, just a little sprinkles. You felt sprinkles? Eh? Yeah, and I was ahead of you. It hailed here for about five minutes. No, it didn't. Yes, it did. I got it on video. It's starting to rain again just as they got down here. What time is it? Uh, 313. 3.13? Made it. We made it, man. We made it. Congratulations, guys. Let's get out of here. Look at this. Just as they got in. Made it out. Just in the neck of time. <laughs> See you guys on the next one.